Okay, this one's from Bitmoji. Uh, I've been training for about a year and nine months. I still can't re reliably armbar from closed guard. Uh, I've been training for almost 10 years and I can't reliably <laughs> uh, armbar from closed guard and upper belts either. Uh, it definitely takes some time to get used to it. Uh, the problem with the closed guard from, from the armbar from closed guard is like one of the first things you learn, but it's also one of the first things you learn to defend from. So, um, you definitely gotta set it up well, and it definitely takes a lot of reps, so you definitely gotta drill it and get your position right. Uh, the way I set it up is uh, set side sleeve. My hand is gonna go behind and grab the tricep. I'm gonna close my elbows, okay? Once I have this here, I really wanna glue this arm to my chest, right down the middle. Foot is gonna go on the hip, I'm gonna make sure I pinch in here. Now, my knee goes to the armpit. I rotate my foot out. I get my angle. Bite down, open the knee to break the posture. Put the pressure up. Make sure you get the 90 degree angle. Uh, the Japanese term for arm bar is uh, jujigatame, which means cross lock. You really gotta make sure you're creating the 90 degree angle in order to do this properly. Otherwise, it's really hard to clear the head with your leg. I'm gonna show that thing we talked about, if you can't clear the head right away? Sure. If, whatever reason, we're here, boom, I get here and Hillary's giving me a hard time to clear the head, what I can do is bite down here, right on the shoulder, squeeze my knees together, and take my time. Most important thing is I keep this here and defend this arm. I don't want her wrapping around, doing, doing weird things here, so I defend it. Now, whenever I'm ready, I can clear and finish. Most important thing is creating your angle and getting this leg high enough so you can go and bite on the shoulder here and eventually clear the leg, clear the head.